Nice to see you again, Dr. Hofstadter. I'm uh, Leonard's friend, Stuart. Nice to see you too. Hi, I'm Stuart. Oh, I'm Alfred, Leonard's father. Oh, oh, hi. Uh, I'm sorry, did you two want to sit together? No. no. <laughs> Wondering why the front row is available. Hey, I think we're ready. Why do people cry at weddings? They're practicing for what's coming later. <laughs> Thank you for cleaning yourself up for your sister's wedding. Thank you for my new teeth. <laughs> Welcome to the family, Leonard. Don't lend your new brother-in-law money. today to celebrate love. <sighs> Sigh louder, no one heard you. Really, I can move. Not just Leonard and Penny's love, but the love we have for them, as well as each other. Speaking of love, STDs among the elderly are skyrocketing. Love is patient, but it's not gonna put up with all the side chatter, so let's knock it off. <laughs> At least she's yelling at someone else for a change. Howard! <laughs> okay, I understand everyone's a little tense today, so I'm just gonna get to the important stuff. Leonard, standing here with you in front of our family friends is bringing up a lot of feelings. Like what a good idea it was to elope the first time. <laughs> <laughs> but also, how incredibly happy you make me. Thank you for marrying me. Hopefully for the last time. <laughs> Penny. As a scientist, my job is to figure out why things happen. But I don't think I'll ever understand how someone like me could get to be with someone like you. You don't... Maybe... I don't need to understand it. I just need to be grateful. I love you, Penny. <laughs> Anybody have anything snarky to say about that? <laughs> Didn't think so. I'd, I'd like to say something. <clears throat> uh, Beverly, I know that we don't bring out the best in each other, but something wonderful did come from our relationship. That young man right there. I couldn't agree more. It's beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's continue. Excuse me, I, I, I need to say something to someone pretty special, and I just can't wait any longer. What's happening? Leonard. <laughs> you and I have our ups and downs, but I have always considered you my family, even before the recent threat of our parents fornicating like wrinkly old rabbits. <laughs> I don't always show it, but you are of great importance to me. Both of you. Oh. Thank you. Okay. I now pronounce you husband and wife. And weird other husband who came with the apartment. 